Ford Motor posted $1.8 billion in first quarter net income, reversing a previous year loss, as the company rebounded from supply chain troubles and commanded top dollar for its pickup trucks and SUVs. Earlier Tuesday, Ford for the second time this year cut prices on its electric Mustang Mach-E, reducing the sticker by as much as 8% on some versions. Ford chief executive Jim Farley told analysts Tuesday that the company by year-end will have cut about $5,000 in costs from the Mach-E since its launch more than two years ago, allowing it to price the SUV more aggressively. Ford's net profit for the January through March period reversed a $3.1 billion loss in the same period last year, which was largely because of an adjustment in the value of Ford's stake in electric truck startup Rivian. Ford said Tuesday that it expects to reopen order banks for the Mach-E this week, and plans to increase production of the model at its plant in Mexico later this year to meet customer demand. Overall, the automaker's annual costs are about $7 billion to $8 billion higher than competitors, Chief Financial Officer John Lawler said after last quarter's earnings.